This is TomorrowPictures.tv. I didn't breathe. George Floyd. Uh, I'm going to in Washington, D.C. We're going to do something that uh, people have to see before. In the brief span of 30 odd years, the world has seen an inventor's dream. This is no simple reform. Freedom and human dignity. It really is a revolution. You could ask yourself a question. Teach you how to kill. Do I feel lucky? We're like the stupid people. Far more powerful than anything man has yet devised. Inspiration and hope. Life is visceral. Tearing down that wall. Buy a for a man. Because we had stupid politicians doing stupid things. Let's get this straight. The United States. Enough about his life. and boldly. Stupid. Because, uh, like being a Trump supporter, I love Trump. Uh, but a lot of people are just like, he's ridiculous, he's a joke. I think he's just getting the media attention now and uh, will later actually do good for our country. Aren't you a little afraid of the fact that people are taking him as a joke and he may himself be taking himself as a joke? Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I feel like he shouldn't be doing himself this way and he should just be doing good. He should change the way he should. He's such a bully. We haven't. No. He bullies. He's gonna bully every country, and then where are we gonna be? Uh, Trump 2K16. Make America great again. Don't. No. Trump 2K16. Yeah. All right. How do you feel about that compared to the guns and issues that we have here in the states and the killings that have been done here, especially in the schools? In the schools? Okay. Well, like the gun problem, I feel like again. What, what's your specific, like, are you saying in referring like, to what? The guns are related to... You think there's a way that we should possibly ban all guns or ban all uh, a certain type of people that are likely to use the guns as we would the Muslims coming into the country? No, like, of course you'd have, like, background checks because you don't want, like, anybody who's, like, has, like, a obvious, like, mental deficiency to get their hands on, like, a weapon. But at the same time, it's your right to be able to, like, own a weapon. Like, who's to say, like, you can't, like... These people outside the country, these Muslims that we're not letting in, they're not American citizens. As an American citizen, it's your right to own a weapon, though. So. You guys are all saying no way. You're saying no way to gun control? No. And you're, I'm assuming you're coming from the city, so you're not hunters? Not really the city. No, outside, outside of the city. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Delaware County. Hunters? My dad's a hunt. My dad hunts. Yeah. So, how do you feel about the gun control issues? Um, I don't really like think it's that big of an issue. I mean, if people are gonna do bad stuff and kill people, they're gonna find other ways to do it. So. And just because, like, just because like an issue doesn't necessarily affect you as an individual, you shouldn't be like selfish enough to not like think of the other people. Like, maybe like I don't have a problem with like giving up my gun, but if someone wants to, like, it's their right. Like, who am I to say what they can do with their like? Then the only people who are gonna have guns are criminals. They're gonna. That's yeah. true. So. And banning guns isn't gonna, gonna get rid of guns. It just gives more power things, to the government. Things have been. Power. Other things have been banned before, like alcohol. Like that has been banned before, and people still had it. And so I think that there's people are gonna find ways to go around it anyway. Yeah, yeah. Look at Europe. It's collapsing. That's <laughs> Uh, tonight, we'd like to say a uh, special thanks. We don't have much time to thank everybody, and especially to our friends in the business and to our wonderful friends here and all of you out there for your great loyalty. Justice will be served. I would simply like to say that I think this has been one of the great days of America. <laughs>